I can't believe how tired I am. I don't even want to think about going to work tomorrow. It finally happened! It finally happened! Yay, hurrah! It finally happened! Matt, it's 2 a.m. in the morning. I just got home from work. I can't even think I'm so tired. Ian, the greatest thing that could ever happen to any city anywhere has just happened to our city. How can you sleep at a time like this? Matt, I'm really sorry. I just gotta go to bed. Can we talk about this tomorrow? Ian, they just opened a chocolate cake factory two miles away from here. Do you know what that means? Uh, I, I don't know, Matt. Ian, that means all our dreams can finally be realized! That's great, Matt. Can we realize them tomorrow? Ian, you don't understand. They serve food from all over the world at the chocolate cake factory. Finally, you can eat sweet and sour chicken with a side order of tacos! Yeah, that sounds great, Matt, but I'm, I'm really tired right now. I gotta go to bed. Hey, guys, can I get a little help over here? Who the fuck is this? Ian, that's no way to talk to our waiter! Our waiter? Uh, yeah, how else do you think we're gonna place our order? Matt, this isn't a restaurant, it's my bedroom. Now can you both please leave? Excuse his attitude, Sebastian. I don't know why he's acting this way. But I think we're gonna have to go with combination platter number six, tacos and sweet and sour chicken. Excellent choice. Can I recommend a side order of coleslaw with that? Can you both please leave? Someone's being a moody duty over here. What the fuck is going on here? I'm trying to run a restaurant. Who the fuck are you? I'm the Central East District Manager of the Chocolate Cake Factory. I got orders in the window, people. This isn't a restaurant. This is my bedroom, and everyone's got to go. Mr. Winston, I think we're having a problem with this particular guest. I think you're right. Somebody get a gurney out here! Hi guys, excuse me, coming through, coming through. Get this piece of shit out of my restaurant! I'm sorry, Mr. Winston. You know, you can dress him up, but you can't take him anywhere. <laughs>